here with Alante Sly as a fox, coming off a of shoulder surgery. A few, what was it like, about five or six months ago, maybe? Uh, yes, yeah, it's, it's, it's been about seven months, man. Seven months now. How's the recovery coming? Coming along really well. Uh, man, we back about 100%. We should be fighting soon. Okay. Probably September 27th. Okay. We at Bowie State, man. I don't know if we're supposed to announce that yet, but. Yeah, I heard, I heard about a car getting put yeah. together. I think, uh, is it. Real deal and, and, yeah, and Shabazz. Yeah, real deal is doing that. Yeah. So hopefully, man, hopefully we definitely get in on it. Yeah. With with the shoulder surgery, how 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 did all that come about? Cause you know, knowing the, the the injury was that from the fight? It was from the fight. And oh, let me let me let me clear this up. Okay. It wasn't just shoulder surgery. So first, before I got my shoulder looked at, uh -huh. I got my elbow worked on. My elbow. I remember I, that. I told my uh, on our collateral ligament. And uh, that, that just stops with a block and stuff like that. So that um, definitely, that, that, that was my surgery for, that was November 30th. Then we did January 24th for my shoulder. It went on my shoulder to repair my label as the cartilage right there. But then after he went to my shoulder and looked at my shoulder and saw that was torn, he also said that my bicep was torn. So they had to fix my bicep as wow. well. He made a whole new incision while doing that procedure. Wow. Yeah, so, wow. Yeah. So he did some exploratory surgery going in there and found some things yeah, that he needed yeah, to fix. Yeah, he needed to fix it. I mean, you know, wow. basically, I'm the bionic man. Man, you can see all the scars here, man. I see him, yeah. That's my, that's my elbow scar. This is the scar for my bicep right here. Man. Shoulder scars. I think I got one more scar on my back. I can't ever point to it, though. Wow. You know? So they thought it was going to be an arthroscopic surgery, but... Ended up being some serious stuff. So when they going in, you didn't know that. No. So how did you take that when they f told you exactly what they did to you coming out of surgery? I mean, I, I, I was I was grateful. I was glad they fixed whatever else they need to fix. You know, mm -hmm. I was I just basically happy, happy as hell. You know, because I, I don't want to go into a fight with an injury that I don't know I had. Exactly. Yep. And then you know, worse than that injury, and then we tear or we you know mess up the old injuries. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, now I'm just, just ready to be back. So you you got a good team working on you. Who, who, you know, is it orthopedic? Basically, they they was working on you. And um, with that with that being said, man, like you said, they got everything out the way. So you squared away. You you back in training. How long did it take you to actually get back into using an arm? Man, um, after the, okay, after the first surgery, it took about three weeks. That was that was surgery on my elbow. That was about three weeks, right? The elbow surgery. What kind of what kind of training you were doing with the elbow surgery? Just basically this this strengthening. Yeah, trying to yeah, strengthen strength my more so my forearms, right? to stabilize my forearm, my bicep. But mm -hmm. uh, between that time, uh, it took me about a month before I could do that. And then I got to maybe like four or five weeks, maybe something like that, before I um, I went back uh, to get my shoulder. And once I did my shoulder, I had to sit down for like three months. It was like, yeah, it was like, it was like three. Was so like now you're back into full training now? Full training Sparring now. and everything? Sparring, running my miles, everything. everything. Oh, okay. So you're back into boxing shape, basically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. With with that being said, you said probably September you'll be back. Uh, what type of fight? Just something to get you back, acclimated back into to the boxing ring again? Uh, it looked like they about to jump me out there, for real. Oh, okay. I, was, I forgot the guy's name. Uh-huh. It must be 21 and 0 with some, okay. some knockouts. Okay. So okay. Nice. Be nice because you left on a plateau where you was you was already up there right. anyway. Right. So now it's like, oh, is it really his arm or is it him? Exactly. And now I need to show him that it was my arm. Oh, okay. So now you, you got something to prove. Yeah, definitely got something you know, to prove. <laughs> you, you know, you, you, you won that that what was it the, the, the WBC uh, US NBC yeah. title. Matter of fact. When, when all the work you've been through, all the setbacks you had, when your career actually picked back up again, cause I remember you going through things with management and yeah, things yeah, like yeah. that. Then I you got back into a flow. That, yeah. So now you're back into a flow, and then you had to set back with the surgery. Uh -huh. But now, still, you were the promoter that can actually put you back into the mix real right, quick. Right, right, right. Uh, not only promoter, man, promote. Of course, shout out to Bella Entertainment, but my advisor, Michael Rao, is, he's amazing. Mm -hmm. you know, he's, doing, he's doing his thing. He has the connections to really put me back on top as soon as possible. Mm -hmm. And now that you, you're fighting, is that one? It's gonna still be a 160, 168. I'm, I'm gonna do, we can still do 160. Okay. And uh, I think, but I think this next fight maybe it might be a little heavier than once it, just just so we can get back into the flow of things. And then yeah, 160, I still be making my campaign there. Yeah, okay, so 160, that's just pretty much solid for you. Yeah, that's standing. Solid for you. How how? Look, is it is it 
But now, now I, I got to say, because you've been training for a long time, so making weight is not an issue. You know you have to do that anyway. Right. So is that that's that's not really a problem that's now since really you know. Issue. Okay, but, so. I mean, you know, with this, with this all time, I did put on some weight. But I, I need to make sure I can get down to 160. That's why, that's why we're going to do a little heavier than 160. Okay, fight, okay. To get the next one. And then the next fight. See how your body feels exactly. going down. Okay. That's why I need to be at 160. We'll probably be able to be at 160. Okay, so next time we see you. Or hear about you be September. September 22nd. Bowie State, hopefully. State University. There we go. Lante Slides of Fox. He'll be right back in action. All healed up. Strengthened up. Back in condition.